Hello, everybody. All right, welcome. I'm Gina Ogren. I'm the founder of Go Fitness Virtual. We're getting ready to do cardio strength this morning. Um, hello, Linda. Uh, cardio strength, you're going to um, start off behind your chair, like I do in all my, almost all my classes, right? I like that chair out in front of you. You're gonna work behind it, doing your cardio portion, and then we'll, we'll do a weight section for the second part of class, and then for the third part of class, um, we will work more focused on our abdominals, so you can actually sit in the chair, or you can do your ab workout on the floor. It doesn't matter, and I don't care. It's whatever you feel comfortable with, so it's totally, totally, totally up to you. Um, as we start though, again, I, I'm going to move my chair out of the way, which I might need it today because I'm still on the boat going back and forth. So we're going to see how, how this is. It's interesting. I've been, I think, I don't think I've ever been out that many days in a row. So it, it feels like, yeah, I'm still in the boat. I'm really excited for the time that this goes away. Mm -hmm. I took Benadryl last night, which I think made me more tired when I tried to get up this morning, um, to try to get rid of that. So if anybody knows how to get rid of that, let me know, because I would really love to have that out the door. So I'm hoping that exercise will, will cause it to be better. We'll see. <laughs> it might be wishful thinking. Who knows? All right, let's march it out. Yeah, apparently the dog didn't like it very much. Yeah. Oh, no, I, I just, um, this weekend, I went to um, the Lake of the Ozarks with my girlfriends from... Uh, golly, from college. So if we hadn't seen each other for 22 years, some of us. So I have this dizziness. It's like, it's not really dizziness. I just feel like I'm still on the boat. Yeah, so a little rocking. That's what's happening. I took Benadryl because I thought maybe it would help with the, um, with uh, like stabilizing me somehow. I don't know, I just took it before bed because if I take Benadryl, I, I thought maybe it would help. I didn't know what to take. I took a Zyrtec the other day. I don't know why I would think that would help with dizziness, but I thought I'd try anything. It's not really dizzy. I just feel like I'm rocking. Just like this all the time. So I'm trying to get ready this morning and I'm like, gosh, the counter's still moving. It just feels like I'm on a cruise ship or something. You know how when you get off a cruise ship, it takes you a day or two to get used to it? Yeah. So I don't know, if you guys have any brilliant ideas, let me know and uh, I'll try them all. Reach across. Good. Yeah, it's such a weird thing because I won't feel it and then all of a sudden it'll come back and then I won't feel it for a little bit. And when you drive down to the Ozarks, it's really a windy road to their cabin and so uh, I think that doesn't help me. So I've taken a lot of Tums and I had to eat chips. So only like bread product that we had. Yeah, so it's just not, not lovely. I don't feel horrible. I've definitely felt worse in my life, that's for sure. Good, but those of you that are boaters or on the water, maybe there's a trick out there that I just don't know about, so. But yeah, I don't think I've ever gone three days on the water, so we'll see. And march it. Now we're gonna tap it in, elbow comes in. I'm gonna come closer and read what you guys have to say. Hello, Elizabeth, yay! Hi, Anna, good morning. Dramamine. Okay, that's a good idea. Dramamine's a good idea. I don't think I have any. But I haven't taken that. I should I should do that. You're exactly right, Kath. Thank you. See, I knew if I throw it out there, somebody'd give me a good idea. It's funny that you would think that you would need it while you're doing it, but sometimes as I've gotten older, that's been a problem with things. Like, I can't go on roller coasters and stuff anymore. Elbow to that opposite knee. Now swing the arms, tap back. I luckily never
never got sick sick, but there were several of us that didn't feel fabulous every moment. Good, now diagonals. But it was fun, we got to jet ski and go on the boats and there's all sorts of toys, so it was very fun. Good, now kick back. I'm sure there's some prescription out there that I could get for sure, but Dramamines, I'm going to get it today, Kath. That's over the counter, I can find that one. And march it in. Okay, so now that we're kind of getting warmed up, hey Claudia, good to see you. We're gonna take one foot in front, we're gonna set the heel down, just take both hands right on the top of that leg, push back, feel that stretch. Breathe in, and exhale. Breathe in, and exhale. And march it again. All right, Cheryl, what are you saying? Okay, yeah, okay, well, Carol, check that out. She has something else that she uses. Might be behind my other screen. I can read part of your messages sometimes. Breathe in, exhale. I know that they make like wrist bands and different things. It's like that same feeling, kind of, well, that nauseous feeling that you get when you're pregnant or first pregnant or whatever. I know they have bracelets and different things that are supposed to help. I just need to check it out. Now the elbow comes up. And backstroke. And elbow. Shoulder roll. Take it out wide. And now hands come down right above those knees. Drop one shoulder for me. Feel that stretch. You might feel it in the inner thigh, down your back. And switch. And switch again. And switch. And center, round it up, deep breath in. Exhale, breathe in, and exhale. Okay, go ahead and grab a drink. Who else hopped on? I get your guys' names while we're on a commercial break. Go Fitness Virtual is more than just live virtual fitness classes. You'll also find Go Fitness University. We started Go Fitness University as a place to hold all of our brief lessons and focused educational content. Most are three to five minute videos. You'll find videos illustrating modifications to certain exercises and a few short morning stretching and warmer routines. And as we interview topical experts, those videos and articles will also become part of the library of content that we call Go Fitness University. Now water breaks over, enjoy class. All right, everybody grab a drink except for me. Okay. All right, back to our marching. Okay, we're gonna take a step touch over to the side. And press down. Press those arms down. Good. Now reach forward, pull back. I'm coming up. Yeah, I will, Debbie. I have. She said if it keeps up, calling me antique. I do have one, so. And press. 
My chiropractor has helped me too, like if the crystals in my ears get off, I've had that feeling before. It's just kind of, that's more of a dizzy all over. This just feels like I'm still on the boat. And reach forward. But I have people, I just thought if there was a medicine out there that could help really fast, that'd be great. And tap back. Keep it going. I'm sneaking forward so I can read again. Okay, great. Thank you, Carol. Lay curls. I'll go get the dram me when I get done teaching today. I used to have some, but I think it's so old that it's like turned different colors in the package. You know, you'd think maybe throw it away. Yeah. Yeah, that's what I need to do. I need to throw a lot of things away. Keep it up. The lake house that we're at, my friend is so organized. It is like, there is nothing that's not in the perfect spot. It's absolutely fascinating. She's always been this way. You might be one of those people or you might know someone that is. It's amazing. Like, I want to be her when I grow up. Lift, tap back. Keep going. And now reach up as you're tapping back. Nice, keep it up, keep it up. Now take a leg curl as you're lifting the hands. Good. Now both arms put out just a little farther. That's it, that's it. Now take it double, double one leg, double the other. Good. Now push out. Now push it down and back. Keeping those doubles going. March it in. All right, just a toe tap in front. Bring that other elbow kind of in front. Keeping that tap. Now, if you want to take those arms a little bit higher and rotate, one in front then the other. Feel that core work. Now you can reach it up, pull it down. Good. March it wide. Okay, we're going to press the hand down. So press, press. And punch center. Reach it up. Press down again. Good. 
and punch. Reach it up. One more time through, press down. Palm is pressing toward that floor. Punch center. Now reach each hand up. Reach. Now we're going to lift the leg out to the side a little bit more as we reach up. Start working that balance a little bit. You know me and balance. I love to teach you, which is a good thing considering mine's off. Yes, I do think that has helped. And march it in. Good. All right. One foot in front of the other. We're going to take that rocking horse. You're going to tap in front, tap back. So from the side, tap, tap. You can keep it low. You can lift the knee, curl the leg, taking it up a little higher. You can take your arms over your head and pull back. March it in. Now switch those legs. Other one. Here we go. Toe tap. Toe tap. Now you can lift the knee. Lift that heel up towards your rear. Now take those arms up. Pull back. All right, step touch. One arm in front, one arm behind. And push your hands out to the side. And push them down and back. Keep the feet out wide, big tap. Big tap back with the feet are apart. Still keeping the elbows up, pushing those palms toward the back wall. Back to the step touch. Now reach across, pull to your waist. Pull your hands like you're reaching out, grabbing something and pulling it back toward your waist. And now let's go shoulder height. And now you're reaching up at the diagonal, pulling down. Palms are out in front, fingers toward the ceilings, push it out. Good, bicep curls, heels in front. Knee lift. You can stay with those heels in front if you want. March it in. Deep breath. Exhale down. Stick one more. And exhale down. Great job. Okay, everybody grab a drink. 
Hi, Diana, great to see you. Oh, okay, Carol, lower sodium and less caffeine. Ooh, okay, that could be part of my problems right there. Hi, Shirley. Hi, Diane. Quick break. Go Fitness Virtual is more than just live virtual fitness classes. Bernie's Technology Corner is where you can find technology tips and tricks and answers to many of your technology challenges. You can also find answers to other FAQs or frequently asked questions. Now enjoy the rest of the workout. Hello, Janice. Oh, okay, good, Janice. Thank you for that little tidbit. I appreciate it. You guys are helping me out. Yeah, I've never had it this bad, but I don't think I've ever don't gone that many days on the boat. You know, and playing down there, I don't know. It's usually like a day and a half. I don't remember it being being like this, so who knows. But thank you. I appreciate all those messages. Okay, so now we're going to grab weights. So we're going to do handheld weights. I should have told you to get them before. Okay, so if you don't have handheld weights in your house, just grab water bottles, something that adds a little resistance that you can work those muscles, okay? We're gonna take our feet about hip distance apart, and we're gonna take it into a squat. So when we go into that squat, remember, we tuck the tailbone under, we push our butt back. The knees are not over your toes, they're behind your toes, okay? Tuck under, and then as you come up, you curl, okay? Ready, here we go. Squat, curl. Squat, curl. Breathe in, exhale. Nice, exhale. Every time you come up, you're always breathing in when it's nice and easy and you're coming down. And rest. My watch is barking at me here. Okay, I'm gonna grab some Fan time. If they need to turn on their fan, go ahead and do that. All right, one foot in front. Okay, that one leg is in front. Weights are straight up and down. You're gonna tap in front of the knee, pull back. Your entire body is still in that runner's lunge, front knee bent, back leg straight, except for your arms. There should be the only thing moving, so don't move your body. Just your arms, so from the side, it's a little easier to see. Just those arms. And rest, now switch. And take it back, here we go, tap, pull back. Same exact movement, different leg in front. Good job. And take it up. All right, now with our palms out, you can kind of see that elbow's in. Hi, Tanya. Good. Up and down. Sorry, got a little. Kathy, I'll try that Epley maneuver. There's something you can do online which I've done before when I've had problems, but. I have inner ears, like my ears pop all the time. So sometimes I think it's fluid moving around. So when I went into the ENT, she said, actually it's a gift to be able to pop your ears the way you can. I'm like, really? She said, yes, and you don't have to worry about the pressure building up so much. I'm like, okay, whatever you tell me. But I'll try that Epley maneuver too. And rest, because you can do it by yourself and then you can also have the chiropractor do it for you. Or a physical therapist, out and in. Elbows in, hands straight up and down. Tap in front, take it out.
All right, feet together, palms back. Now we're gonna lift, lift. It doesn't feel as bad as when I uh, really had the inner ear deal. Oh, that was awful. I couldn't even teach, it was bad. And rest. Okay, so now with one foot front, you're going to curl both arms. One's going to go up, then the other one goes up, and then we're going to take them down together. So it's a hammer curl, elbows in, tap in the shoulder, one, then the other, and down. Curl, one, other, and down. Down. Curl, press, press, and down. Curl, press, press, and down. Now just switch your feet. You're going to do that same thing. Curl, press, press, and down. Curl, press, press, and down. Press, press. And down. Last one. Curl, press, press, and down. Elbows nice and high. We're going to kick back. Rotate your palms as you're pushing back. Knees are bent. Extending those arms. Good job. And rest. All right, we're going to take a step out, reach across, and then go the other way. Step out, reach across toward the knee with that weight. One side, then the other. One side, then the other. Let's go one more each side and set them down. Hello, and thank you for joining us for the short sample of one of my Go Fitness Virtual fitness classes. I'm Gina Ogren, the founder of GoFitnessVirtual.com. And I'm John Ogren, Gina's husband and sidekick. If you like this sample of Gina's class, we hope you'll visit us at GoFitnessVirtual.com, where we have over 800 recorded fitness classes designed for active older adults. We also have live classes almost every day. That's right. Just go to GoFitnessVirtual.com and click the Get Started button to learn about becoming a member. And remember to subscribe to our YouTube channel. Hope to see you in class. You should always consult with your physician before engaging in any physical activity program. By participating in this online exercise class, you assume all dangers, hazards, and risks of such participation. The exercise demonstrated by the instructors in this online class are physically demanding. If you are unable to safely perform these exercises, please modify them for your own safety or choose a different set of exercises. Remember, it's your body and your responsibility. If you like this lesson, come visit us at GoFitnessVirtual.com.